Hi and welcome to another Instrument Choice support video. In this video we'll show you how to set up and give an overview of the functions of the ICXC0430 digital rain gauge with temperature. To get started, install the batteries into the rain sensor. Use a small screwdriver to open the battery compartment on the base of the unit. Install four AA batteries observing the polarity. Then replace the battery compartment lid and screw into place. Then install two AA batteries into the indoor console. The LCD will light up. The indoor console and rain gauge will automatically search for, connect and begin transmitting data. Wait for the rain measurement to appear on the screen to indicate the rain sensor and console are communicating. When the rain measurement appears on the screen, connection has been successful. On the first section of the main screen is where you can see the since icon, history icon, time, ice alert, if this is switched on, date, alarm modes and alarm icon. The next section on the screen is rainfall information. Currently we can only see a rainfall reading and the rainfall information histogram. Further information as shown in the image will display depending on unit setup and selections. On the outdoor weather information block we can see the current temperature as well as the out indicator and outdoor signal strength indicator. The min max indicator, high low alert and alarms and the low battery indicator for the outdoor sensor will appear in this block of information when applicable. The last section on the screen is the indoor information. Currently on the screen we can see the in indicator, current humidity and current temperature. The min max indicator and low battery indicator for the indoor unit will appear in this section too when applicable. We'll start with the setup of time settings. Press and hold the clock button on the back of the unit for 2 seconds until 12 or 24 hour flashes. Use the up and down selection buttons to move between the options, then press the clock button again to proceed to the next setting. Repeat the same using the clock to confirm and the selection arrows for getting the hour, minute, year, month, date or date month view, month, date, hour offset and language. Next is alarm setup. Press the alarm button on the back of the unit to show the alarm time. Press the alarm button again to activate the alarm and press it a third time to activate the alarm with ice alert function. Or to disable the alarm, keep pressing the button until the alarm icon disappears. To set the alarm time, press and hold the same alarm button down for 2 seconds to enter alarm setting mode. Use the up and down selection buttons to adjust the hour, then press the alarm button to proceed to the minute. Repeat the same to adjust the minute alarm, then press alarm again to confirm and exit alarm setup. The next is rainfall setup. The device displays how many millimetres or inches of rainfall have accumulated over a one hour time period based on the current rainfall rate that is updated every minute. There will be no data to display as we've only just switched this unit on. To select the rainfall display mode, press the rain button on the front of the unit to toggle between the rate, this is the current rainfall rate for the past hour, hour, the hour display indicates the total rainfall from on the hour, day, the day display indicates the total rainfall from midnight, week, the week display indicates the total rainfall from the current week, Month, the month display indicates the total rainfall from the current calendar month. And last of all, year, the year display indicates the total rainfall from the current calendar year. Press the Since button on the front of the unit to display the total rainfall record. The data and the year will be shown. To clear the current commentary date and reset it to start again, press and hold the Since icon. The total rainfall will now be equal to the current day, and the unit will restart collecting the rainfall data. To switch between the display of rainfall in millimetres and inches, use the toggle keys on the back of the unit. And the same with adjusting the temperature display between Celsius and Fahrenheit. Press the memory key to run through the minimum and maximum records. View the maximum outdoor temperature, minimum outdoor temperature, maximum indoor, minimum indoor temperature, maximum and minimum indoor humidity, and the maximum rainfall along with a corresponding timestamp on the top corner for the hour, day, week, month and year. To clear individual records, go to the display of record you wish to clear, then press and hold the memory button for two seconds to clear that record. Next is alert setup. High and low alerts inform you of certain weather conditions have been met. Once activated, the alarm will turn on and the red LED will start to flash. 
The following areas and types of alert are provided. High and low alerts for indoor temperature and humidity and outdoor temperature, and high alerts for hourly and daily rainfall. To set up the high and low alerts, press the alert button until the desired parameter is selected and flashing on the screen. Then use the up and down buttons to adjust the setting. Once you have set the desired threshold, press alert again to confirm and continue to the next parameter. To turn any of the alerts on or off, on is indicated by the icon on the screen, press the alert button until the desired area is selected, then press alarm to turn the alert on or off. Press alert again to continue to the next setting. The last part of setup is data clearing. During the installation of the wireless sensor, the sensors were likely triggered at some stage, resulting in erroneous rainfall measurements. So, after the installation, it's a good idea to clear this data. Do this by pressing and holding the history button for three seconds. Then press the up and down selection arrows to choose between yes for reset or no to return to the measurement screen. Press the history button to confirm your selection. And if yes is selected, this will clear any data recorded. And that's how to set up the ICXC0434 digital rain gauge with temperature. For more information on this or other rain gauges, speak with an instrument choice scientist. Call 1300 737 871 or view further contact information in the video description. We hope that you found this video helpful. Thanks for watching.